To reach a goal is hard, is easy to say, but to pursue that as a career going forward. Uh, I feel very proud and honored to be that way. I feel extremely uh, proud, extremely grateful to be given this opportunity. Uh, at the same time, uh, the feeling of achieving your dreams is very gratifying. Uh, and I also feel a huge commitment and a sense of how important this is for the UAE and for the Arab world. The fact that I was selected to be part of the program, I think, is enough, an, uh, enough of an encouragement to uh, all uh, girls who want to enter the space field to go ahead and enter, uh, be it through uh, becoming scientists or uh, by be uh, training or uh, working hard towards becoming an astronaut. Being a part of an astronaut uh, team from all over the world, or from NASA especially, that will give us uh, that uh, I, will, I would love to be sharing some cultures with them the, the first uh, uh, fall. And we'll be working a team for a big project in the future with NASA and, and, uh, and space field. So uh, culture also, it's a part of uh, team working. Uh, I hope uh, my experience in the aviation field, uh, that will be supporting for a bigger mission in future in space. And I am looking forward to be trained there in NASA and be a part of uh, new missions. My ambition is to be the, in the team or that uh, to discover the moon and be part of, uh, uh, of that. This is my uh, ambition in the future. Today, by selecting astronauts that are going to go to low Earth orbit around Earth, those astronauts also can contribute and work towards what's happening around the Moon in the next couple of decades. And then, of course, towards Mars, where the UAE can play an active role. So the UAE is playing an active role in unmanned exploration of Moon and Mars. We look for the next phase, which is manned exploration in collaboration with our international partners.